Brain tumours present a formidable challenge in the realm of cancer treatment. Their location within the complex and delicate environment of the brain necessitates innovative and targeted therapies. The emergence of voracidenib, a novel oral medication, offers a beacon of hope for patients battling these challenging tumours. This groundbreaking treatment represents a significant advancement in our understanding and management of brain tumours. Voracidenib's unique mechanism of action targets specific genetic mutations that drive the growth of these tumours, offering a new approach to combating this complex disease. The development of voracidinib marks a pivotal moment in cancer research. It demonstrates the power of precision medicine, tailoring treatments to the unique genetic makeup of individual tumours. This targeted approach minimises the impact on healthy brain tissue, reducing the debilitating side effects often associated with traditional cancer therapies. Voracidinib's potential to improve patient outcomes and quality of life is substantial. Its introduction into the clinical arena marks a new dawn in brain tumour treatment. For years, patients and medical professionals alike have sought more effective and less toxic treatments for brain tumours. Voracidenib's arrival signifies a major step towards realising this goal. Its targeted approach offers a more precise and potent weapon against these challenging tumours. The promise of improved survival rates and reduced side effects is a testament to the relentless pursuit of scientific advancement. Voracidinib stands as a symbol of hope for patients and their families, ushering in a new era of possibility in the fight against brain tumours. Voracidinib is a small molecule inhibitor designed to target specific mutations in the isocitrate dehydrogenase enzymes IDH1 and IDH2. These mutations are commonly found in certain types of brain tumours, particularly low-grade gliomas and glioblastomas. Mutated enzymes produce an oncome metabolite called 2-hydroxyglutarate, which disrupts cellular processes and fuels tumour growth. Voracidinib acts by selectively inhibiting the mutated IDH enzymes, blocking the production of 2-HG. This targeted action disrupts tumour growth, leading to tumour regression and improved patient outcomes. Unlike traditional chemotherapy, voracidinib minimizes impact on healthy cells, reducing side effects. Voracidinib exemplifies personalized medicine, treating brain tumors based on their unique genetic profile. Brain tumors present a unique set of challenges for medical professionals. The brain, encased within the protective skull, is a complex and delicate organ. Accessing tumours within this confined space can be difficult and risky. Traditional surgical approaches often involve invasive procedures that carry the risk of damaging surrounding healthy brain tissue. This delicate balance between removing the tumour and preserving neurological function makes brain tumour surgery a complex undertaking. The blood-brain barrier, a protective mechanism that regulates the passage of substances from the bloodstream into the brain, poses another significant obstacle. This barrier, while essential for maintaining brain health, can also prevent therapeutic drugs from reaching the tumour site. Many conventional chemotherapy drugs are unable to penetrate the blood-brain barrier effectively, limiting their efficacy in treating brain tumours. This challenge necessitates the development of drugs specifically designed to overcome this obstacle. Furthermore, the heterogeneity of brain tumours adds to the complexity of treatment. Brain tumours can vary significantly in their genetic makeup, growth rate and response to therapy. This diversity makes it challenging to develop a one-size-fits-all approach to treatment. Personalised medicine, which tailors treatment strategies to the individual characteristics of each tumour, is increasingly recognised as a crucial approach in addressing this heterogeneity. The sensitive nature of brain tissue further complicates treatment. The brain controls vital functions such as cognition, movement and sensation. Damage to healthy brain tissue during treatment can result in significant neurological deficits, impacting patients' quality of life. Minimising collateral damage to healthy brain tissue is therefore a paramount concern in brain tumour treatment. Targeted therapies like Voracidinib offer a promising approach to achieving this goal. Section 4, Voracidinib, addressing the challenges. 
Vorosidinib addresses many challenges in treating brain tumors. Its targeted action against IDH mutations minimizes impact on healthy brain tissue. Unlike traditional chemotherapy, vorosidinib spares healthy cells. This precision reduces debilitating side effects. The oral bioavailability of vorosidinib is a significant advantage. It can be taken by mouth, eliminating the need for IV infusions. This convenience improves patients' quality of life. Vorosidinib penetrates the blood-brain barrier effectively. This overcomes a major obstacle in brain tumor treatment. Section 5. Clinical Trials and Promising Results Clinical trials of vorosidinib have shown promising results in patients with IDH mutant gliomas. In a phase 3 clinical trial, vorosidinib significantly prolonged progression-free survival, the time before the tumor starts to grow again compared to placebo. This positive outcome provides compelling evidence of vorosidinib's efficacy in slowing tumor growth and improving patient outcomes. The results of this trial represent a significant step forward in the treatment of IDH mutant gliomas. The safety profile of vorosidinib has also been encouraging in clinical trials. While some side effects have been reported, they have generally been mild and manageable. This favorable safety profile is particularly important in brain tumor treatment, where minimizing side effects is crucial to preserving neurological function and quality of life. The relatively low toxicity of vorosidinib makes it a well-tolerated option for patients battling these challenging tumours.